How do we gamify? To gamify doesn't mean you need to start, your IT needs to start writing games such as Angry Birds. Gamification is, is just a word and a lot of times it's misleading. Gamification does not mean play games. If you go back here to the definition, it means using the game thinking and game, gaming mechanics using the gaming principles and apply them. It doesn't mean you are creating games. So if I go back to this slide here, so gamification does not equal writing games. So what does it mean? It means using badges, points, competition, rewards, leaderboards, social sharing, like sharing your achievements on Facebook, Twitter, things like that simulation, LMS skins, uh, trigger-based games. It means all of these things. So these are all different levers or tools you have to create engagement within your students. So let's take some real life example. Adobe has this great product called Photoshop, but it's, it, it is so powerful that it gets confusing because there's so many different features. So Adobe, used gaming to increase the engagement with their uh, customers. So basically, every time you do a little thing in Photoshop, when, when, you, when, you, when you download the product and start using it, you are given series of little challenges, such as remove red, red, red eye, or change the crop, crop picture, so on and so forth. So Adobe uses this level-based challenges to increasingly um, make you addicted to their product by using more features of it and that increases the loyalty. The consumers learn how to use the product so they're able to leverage all the features um, and that's how Adobe used uh, the awards, bonus points and challenges and the social recognition by able to share all of these points on Facebook or Twitter to to, to, to teach their customers about the product. This is a leaderboard where you can see different points and who is leading the different badges they, they earn. So if you go back to our presentation, uh, our slide where I'm showing the different human desires. So by, by using those different levels, you're getting different status. And that status is the same human desire you can earn by becoming uh, a, uh, a senator or your uh, a CEO of a company. The gamification does that with few clicks of the buttons. That's why games are so powerful because they give you what you're looking for. So if you go back to the Adobe leaderboard here, the, the Adobe customers are getting the kind of status they're looking for just by playing the game and in the process learning.